Let's do this. Sir Andrew Strauss, thank you for joining us here today in the Middlesex dressing room. It would have been a while since you've been here, in a playing capacity, anyway, nine years. I think I played in your last, I did play in your last test match here at Lords. Is it nice to be back? It is nice to be back and nice to see you again, Finn Dog. A few um, grey hairs this time. You've got grey hairs. I've got, you I, haven't. No, I haven't <laughs> noticed any actually. You, just for men? Just for men? No, not no. just yet. Okay. Not just, I'm um, waiting a couple of years. But it is lovely to be back. I, I mean, apart from the odd sort of auction prize and when you're taking people on tours around Lords, I haven't been back into this dressing room. Um, and it goes without saying, it brings back so many brilliant memories. Uh, my final memory, which was, as you said, in August 2012, was not one of my favourite memories <laughs> when I padded up to a straight one from <laughs> Vernon Philander. But, um, but of course, this was my home. This was, as you know, it's our place of work and um, it still holds a very special place in my heart. So we're here today to talk about your foundation, the Ruth Strauss yeah. Foundation. Um, can you tell us a little bit more because people watching um, and listening to this would know generally what it is and, and the colour associated with it and the cricket days and, and stuff, but can you give us a bit more detail about what it's actually about? Yeah, well, listen, to begin with, it all starts with Ruth, my wife, who, um, as many people will know, uh, was diagnosed with uh, non-smoking lung cancer in December uh, 2017. And over the next year, you know, had to contend with the fact that her ter her diagnosis was terminal and she was going to die of it. And I think one of the things she was absolutely just passionate about was this idea of not uh, sort of having an elephant in the room and understanding and appreciating that preparing herself and the boys and myself for what was to come was crucially important. Um, and so um, we were very fortunate to have great support, uh, pre-bereavement support, I suppose is what you call it, uh, where Ruth and I could talk to Jenny, our counsellor, about how we were feeling, you know, what Ruth's uh, wishes for the future for the boys were, how best for us to engage in conversation with the kids, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, and so before Ruth died, and when we started talking about putting a foundation together in her name, she talked about this idea of um, opening up the conversation about death um, and providing support for families uh, when facing the death of a parent. Uh, and so that's what we're trying to do at the moment. We've got the, the Reece Strauss Foundation Family Support Service where we're giving direct support to people who are going through this awful time in their life. And you know, we shouldn't sugarcoat it. It is an awful thing to go through. Um, and then we're putting together the Reece Strauss Foundation training program, which is helping healthcare professionals to offer that sort of support uh, for their patients and their families as well. So opening up the conversation about death, preparing people uh, for what's to come. And if you do that, then of course it's an awful ordeal for anyone to go through to, to lose a parent, but hopefully both um, the, the, the patient themselves, uh, their partner and their kids on the best possible place to deal with um, that eventuality when it eventually comes. A fantastic charity and we're proud to be able to support it here at Middlesex in all the capacities that we can. And today I have a surprise for you. Um, in a game against Kent, we are gonna be wearing a Ruth Strauss Foundation shirt to help raise awareness and funds hopefully that can help these people that you are trying to help on their journey, um, a very important journey, and I am going to go and... I'm very excited this about this. Now. This is a big moment. <laughs> okay, well that is a great shirt, isn't it? That's fantastic. You're going to look very good in that, Finny, no doubt. Um, but more than that, it, on behalf of the Ruth Strauss Foundation, we're just so grateful for Middlesex's continued support. You know, right from the start, uh, in the months after Ruth died, I really felt huge support from the club. 
and obviously Angus Fraser being a trustee of the Ruth Strauss Foundation, that link is, is a very strong one. So uh, doing this against Kent is going to help raise awareness for the foundation, which we can never have too much awareness. Um, and it makes me very proud to know that the players are going to be wearing the, the shirt in, in support of the Ruth Strauss Foundation. No, the guys are certainly 100% proud to be wearing it and supporting you and, and the foundation. It's something that's very close to our hearts and yeah, seeing you go through that and what you've done after it, everyone's very proud of you um, from Thanks. the club. I can speak on behalf of everyone. There's definitely a few boys who are going to fancy themselves in that. We're taking selfies in the, <laughs> in the mirrors and all sorts. We've got some vain lads in the team. Another thing that the club are going to do to try and support the foundation is that these shirts after we've worn them in the game, are going to be signed um, and auctioned off in order to help the charity raise funds. 100% of those funds are going to go to the charity. So please, when you see the link to bid on the shirts, um, they're going to be signed and you can buy those and the funds go straight to the Ruth Strauss Foundation. And also, on the day that we wear the kit against Kent in the Vitality Blast, these shirts are going to be on sale beforehand and you're able to buy them and the proceeds, a proportion of the proceeds will go to the Ruth Strauss Foundation and hopefully that will raise more funds to help people um, whose families went through something similar to what Andrew went through. So hopefully as a result of all this we can raise some funds, raise awareness and do a lot of great things for a great charity. Yeah, thanks Finney. And, um... Look, the Ruth Rouse Foundation is so proud of our link to cricket. Obviously, we, we've had the Red for Ruth Day in the test matches, but um, it means so much to us that the, the Middlesex is supporting us in this way. It's going to be great to see the players wearing that shirt out in the middle. I think you're going to look great in it, Finney. Get your, get your selfie ready to go. <laughs> um, and for the Middlesex supporters as well to be wearing red and supporting us, that's going to feel very special and it's going to help with the awareness as well. So we're delighted that you're, you're helping us out. Uh, I think that little bit of red's going to bring a bit of change of luck on the pitch as well, Finn Dog. Fingers crossed.